Utah CDL practice test. Question 1. If you double your speed, how much more distance will it take to stop? Four times as much. Three times as much. Twice as much. Five times as much. Answer. Four times as much. Question 2. Which of the following is the key steering component? Leaf spring. Gearbox. Bearing plate. Torque rod. Answer. Gearbox. Question 3. Which of these is not part of the basic method for shifting up? Release the clutch. Accelerate while pressing the clutch and turning toward the driver's side. Push in the clutch and shift into higher gear at the same time. Release the clutch and press the accelerator at the same time. Answer Accelerate while pressing the clutch and turning toward the driver's side. Question 4. Which of these are you not responsible for it when it comes to your cargo? Making sure that cargo is properly secured. Recognizing possible overloads. Inspecting the cargo. Ensuring the freshness of sealed cargo. Answer. Ensuring the freshness of sealed cargo. Question 5. What is a common cause of tire fires? Overinflated tires. Cold tires. Underinflated tires. All of the above. Answer. Underinflated tires. Question 6. Total stopping distance is a combination of Braking distance plus stopping distance Reaction distance plus viewing distance plus braking distance Perception distance plus reaction distance plus braking distance Reaction distance plus braking distance Answer Perception distance plus reaction distance plus braking distance. Question 7. What might happen if you swing wide to the left before you turn right? Someone might try to pass you, on your left. You might damage your leaf springs. Someone might try to pass you, on your right. All of the above. Answer. Someone might try to pass you, on your right. Question 8. How many hours of sleep does the average person need per night, or risk accumulating sleep debt? 7 to 8 hours. 6 to 8 hours. 8 to 9 hours. 6 to 7 hours. Answer. 7 to 8 hours. Question 9. What can you do at an accident site to help avoid another accident? Stay in your vehicle and do nothing until help arrives. Have a drink to calm your nerves. Put out warning devices so people don't run into the accident site. Leave your vehicle, do nothing, and get to higher ground. Answer Put out warning devices so people don't run into the accident site. Question 10. Before transporting a sealed load, 
You must check. A small sample of whatever is inside. That you don't exceed gross weight and axle weight limits. A picture of whatever is inside. All of the above. Answer. That you don't exceed gross weight and axle weight limits. Question 11. Starting the engine and inspecting the cab involves each of these tasks, except Checking the air pressure gauge Checking the transmission controls Starting the engine, then putting the gear shift in neutral Starting the engine, then listening for unusual noises Answer Starting the engine then putting the gear shift in neutral. Question 12. You should place the starter switch key into your pocket while you are performing the pre-trip inspection because It could damage the starting mechanism. Someone could steal the truck. Someone could start and move the truck. All of the above. Answer. Someone could start and move the truck. Question 13. Which of the following can you not use a BC fire extinguisher on? Grease fire. Electrical fire. Gasoline fire. Wood. Answer. Wood. Question 14. Retarders keep you from skidding on the road because They give you more control over your brakes. They don't, you skid more easily with retarders. They help you control your speed. They help reduce your reaction distance. Answer. They don't, you skid more easily with retarders. Question 15. During your pre-trip test, when examining hoses with the instructor, you need to look for The location of the dipstick Phrase in the water pump belt Puddles on the ground Low windshield washer fluid level Answer. Puddles on the ground. Question 16. The most important hand signal you should agree on with a helper is. Go. Turn up the music. Faster. Stop. Answer. Stop. Question 17. How many seconds does it take for a normal tractor trailer to clear a double track? 14 seconds. More than 30 seconds. More than 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Answer. More than 15 seconds. Question 18. What happens when you let the air out of hot tires? It will cool them down. You will be able to continue your journey sooner. It has no effect at all. This is a good idea so the extra pressure is relieved. This is a bad idea because when the tires cool off, the pressure will be too low. Answer. This is a bad idea because when the tires cool off, the pressure will be too low. Question 19. According to Utah's new 2014 laws, for which of the following may you not use your handheld device for driving a CMV? Text messaging. 
using phone hands-free, with wireless devices. Using phone hands-free, with voice-activated technology. Placing a normal call to report a hazard. Answer Text messaging Question 20. Always try to back toward the driver's side because It's more comfortable for turning your neck. Your truck will naturally pull toward the driver's side. You can see better, watching the vehicle rear out the side window. All of the above. Answer You can see better, watching the vehicle rear out the side window. Question 21 which two special conditions indicate that you should downshift? Starting down a hill and finishing a curve. Starting up a hill and finishing a curve. Starting up a hill and entering a curve. Starting down a hill and entering a curve. Answer Starting down a hill and entering a curve. Question 22. What's the definition of a hazard? Something you can easily avoid. A road user or road condition that could be a possible danger. Something you must stop for. Something you can safely ignore. Answer. A road user or road condition that could be a possible danger. Question 23. While driving at night, which beams should you use as often as you can? Novelty lights. Low beams. Emergency flashers. High beams. Answer. High beams. Question 24. What constitutes a hazardous materials placard? Signs on the inside of the vehicle that remind the driver what he is carrying. Signs that help tax collectors determine how much to tax a hazardous cargo. Signs that warn the public to stay at least 1,000 feet away from the vehicle. Signs on the outside of the vehicle that identify the hazard class of cargo. Answer Signs on the outside of the vehicle that identify the hazard class of cargo. Question 25 The minimum tire tread depth for front tires is 4 30 seconds inch depth, 1 30 second inch depth, 1 half inch depth, 3 eighths inch depth. Answer. For 30 seconds inch depth. Question 26. Which of the following should you do when confronted by an aggressive driver? If you can safely do it, call the police from a cell phone. Avoid eye contact. Ignore rude gestures and refuse to react negatively. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 27. On what roads, you should reduce your speed by? One third. One quarter. One half. Sixty percent. Answer. One third. Question 28. How can you determine if your vehicle is equipped with ABS? Check for yellow ABS malfunction lamps on the instrument panel. 
check if your vehicle was manufactured after March 1, 1998, they are required to have the panel light. Look for wheel speed sensor wires that are coming from the rear of your brakes. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 29. Which of the following should you not do if you experience a tire failure? Be aware that a tire has failed. Engage the brakes hard and immediately. Stay off the brake pedal. Hold the steering wheel firmly. Answer. Engage the brakes hard and immediately. Question 30. Which of the following determines the safe speed for going down a steep downgrade? The total weight of the vehicle and cargo. The steepness of the grade. The road conditions. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 31. What will help a drunk sober up? Fresh air. Time. A glass of water. Coffee. Answer. Time. Question 32. What is not one of the four skill areas that operating a commercial vehicle requires? First aid certification. Accelerating. Safely backing. Steering. Answer. First aid certification. Question 33. Why should you cover cargo? To protect individuals from any spilled cargo. To protect your cargo from bad weather. Because many states require it. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 34. What is the best way to figure out how many seconds of following distance you have? Get one fourth closer to the car in front of you, then back off again. Multiply how long this took you by four for following distance. Text a friend and tell them to text you back in 10 seconds and see how long that seemed to take compared to far you traveled. Use the stopwatch on your phone to try to determine how long before you reach a mile marker after the car in front of you appeared to reach it. Wait until a vehicle passes a shadow or landmark, and count the seconds until you pass it. Answer Wait until a vehicle passes a shadow or landmark, and count the seconds until you pass it. Question 35. How many tie downs are required for a 20 foot load? One tie down. Two tie downs. Three tie downs. Four tie downs. Answer. Two tie downs. Question 36. How long will you lose your CDL driving privileges if you are convicted of a second DUI offense in either CMV or your private vehicle? Five years minimum. Ten years minimum. One year minimum. Life. Answer. Life. Question 37. How often must you stop to check your cargo while on the road? Within the first 15 miles. 
every 3 hours or 150 miles. After each break you take while you're driving. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 38. You don't want to be a distracted driver, so you. If possible, turn off your cell phone until you reach your destination. Smoke, eat, and drink during straight portions of the road. Have all your emotionally hard conversations in the first hour of driving. Only read maps or your phone when there are no cars around you. Answer If possible, turn off your cell phone until you reach your destination. Question 39 What is the gross vehicle weight, GVW? A vehicle's maximum weight rating, specific by its manufacturer. The total weight of a single vehicle and its load. The total weight that includes the vehicle, towed vehicles, and the load. All of the above. Answer. The total weight of a single vehicle and its load. Question 40. Do empty trucks have the best braking? Yes. Yes but only on wet surfaces. No. Yes, but only if the truck is newer than 1998. Answer. No. Question 41. Why is it important to use a helper when backing? Because people feel more comfortable when you do. Because you are providing a job for someone else. Because you have blind spots. All of the above. Answer. Because you have blind spots. Question 42. To help you stay alert and safe while driving, you should. Drink coffee if you get drowsy. Avoid medications with warning labels. Have a whiskey to brace yourself. Roll down your windows to get fresh air. Answer. Avoid medications with warning labels. Question 43. How can you start moving without rolling backward? Engage the clutch before removing your foot from the brake. Apply the hand valve. Put on the parking brake whenever necessary. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 44. You should inspect wheel bearing seals for. Tears. Leaking. Broken leaf springs. Twisted axles. Answer. Leaking. Question 45. Which of the following is not something you should check during a trip? Mirrors. Text messages. Tires. Cargo and cargo covers. Answer. Text messages. Question 46. Is it true that as long as the engine is not overheated, it is completely safe to remove the radiator cap? No. Yes, as long as there is no overflow. Yes, as long as the radiator isn't damaged. Yes. Answer. 
No. Question 47. Where should you place your warning devices, if you must stop on a one-way or a divided highway? 50 feet, 100 feet, and 150 feet toward approaching traffic. 10 feet, 100 feet, and 200 feet toward approaching traffic. 100 feet, 200 feet, and 300 feet toward approaching traffic. 20 feet, 50 feet, and 100 feet toward approaching traffic. Answer 10 feet, 100 feet, and 200 feet toward approaching traffic. Question 48 An anti lock braking system will increase a vehicle's ultimate stopping power. Shorten your stopping distance. Keep your brakes from locking up when you brake hard. Let you drive faster. Answer Keep your brakes from locking up when you brake hard. Question 49 If you are traveling at 55 miles per hour in a 30 foot vehicle, you should leave how many seconds of following distance? 7 seconds 6 seconds 3 seconds 4 seconds Answer 4 seconds Question 50 It has just reached freezing which of the following areas is slippery? When looking road A shaded area A bridge All of the above Answer All of the above Thank you for watching the video and wish you will get your driver license soon.